Years ago, a young doctor who worked in the hospital on the Navajo Indian Reservation told him an experience he had one night when an old Native American man with long braided hair came into the emergency room. So how can I help you? I can't help you if you don't speak. I can come to the hospital. As the young doctor pondered the strange question, it occurred to him that perhaps his patient was a tribal medicine man who, according to ancient tribal customs, sought to heal the sick through song and dance rather than modern treatments. I don't dance. Do you dance? But as the old medicine man well knew, it is hard to dance without music. dance often appear strange or awkward to those who cannot hear the music. The dance steps require discipline, but the joy of the dance will only be experienced when we come to hear the music. Sometimes in our homes, we successfully teach the dance steps, but are not as successful at helping our family members to hear the music. If our children learn the dance steps without learning to hear and to feel the beautiful music of the gospel of Jesus Christ, they will over time become uncomfortable with the dance and will either quit dancing or almost as bad will keep dancing only because of the pressure they feel from others who are dancing around them. The dance steps of the gospel are the things we do. The music of the gospel is the joyful spiritual feeling that comes from the Holy Ghost. We learn the dance steps with our minds but we feel the music with our hearts. can hear the music ourselves, we must try our best to perform it in our homes. It is not something that can be forced or compelled. Children's happiness depends on their ability to hear and love the beautiful music of the gospel. Can you teach me to dance? I can teach you to dance, but you have to hear the music.
Welcome to tonight's devotional, all on music for the soul. Have you ever wondered why music touches the soul so well? Well, tonight's devotional is for you. We're going to get started with the prayer and then move on to our musical events. Dear Heavenly Father, we are so grateful for this day and the opportunity we have to listen to the music here in this devotional today. And we ask thee to bless us with thy spirit and can feel thy love today and we say these things in the name of Jesus Christ amen our first event is going to be a rendition of I need thee every hour and lead kindly light played by sister Neidegger on the piano
This is a rendition of I Need Thee Every Hour and Lead Kindly Light. And I love putting these two together because it helps me pair Jesus Christ and his light together and how we and I truly need it every hour. His light is good and it fills me with that peace and joy and I can especially feel it as I play this together. I'm pairing his light and his goodness um, with, with the talent that he's given me and the talent that I want to use to share his light with others. Thank you, Sister Neidegger, for that musical performance. Now we have Brightly Beams, Our Father's Mercy, sung and played by Elder Nixon, Elder Robinson, and Elder Olson. listening we hope you enjoyed that we chose this song because of what the chorus teaches um, that we should always have our lights burning and you know you never know who that's going to help or who that's going to save i love what the scriptures teach that the worth of souls is great in the sight of god and and so you know whatever we can do to help those souls we should do um, so that's why we chose that song thank you elders now we're going to listen to I Need Thee Every Hour, played by Elder Clark on the guitar.
chose this song because um, it has helped me through hard times. Um, I know it can help you as well through hard times. It truly does bring peace into my soul and really makes me realize that I need God every hour. We're now going to listen to a rendition of Love is Spoken Here, played by Elder Bledsoe, Elder Heyman, and Sister Howard. listen to Nearer My God to Thee by Elder Christensen, and we're going to close with the prayer um, and end the live event for tonight.
love the song near my God to thee. It paints a beautiful scenery as we learn of Jacob ascending into heaven. Even though it be a cross that raiseth me, still all my song shall be near my God to thee. I continually strive to come closer to my Savior by reading my scriptures, going to church, and praying every day. I know you can do the same. I say this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank thee for this day and for all the many blessings you have given us. We thank thee for the wonderful and great, amazing music which was played for us tonight. We thank thee for the inspiration and the wonderful spirit you carried out. We're grateful for the words and the melody that was carried to all of our hearts and pray that we will carry this light to others and share the light of Christ. We love thee, Heavenly Father, we're grateful for all thy many blessings and we say these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you for joining tonight's devotional. We hope you felt the spirit and enjoyed those musical numbers. Be sure to tune in Wednesday for our Come and See event. We're going to be cooking some tacos again. And also next Sunday, the live event will be at 6 o'clock. So be sure to tune in to that. Have a great week.